Now, your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you. Baker College may soon be calling the city of Ferndale home. Last night, the Ferndale City Council unanimously approved exclusive negotiating rights with the college. Now, this comes as Baker College plans to close three campuses here in Metro Detroit and, and create one new flagship location. Now, if Ferndale gives the college the green light, the campus will be built on the northwest corner of Bermuda and Nine Mile. There's a new warning this morning about where you swipe your debit card. The consumer financial services company Bankrate says you should think twice before using an outdoor ATM. Bankrate warns thieves can easily get your card number using a skimming device. Gas station pumps are another place you may want to skip. Bankrate says they're known to be less secure and transactions require little supervision. Online purchases can also be risky because of the potential for hacking and be cautious at bars and restaurants. While experts say most servers are trustworthy, it's not a good idea for your card to leave your site. Right now we have temperatures that are in the 20s below freezing once again, but uh, the, this is a big improvement from yesterday morning. 29 degrees right now in Troy. It's 27 in Detroit and Ann Arbor, 25 degrees in Jackson. We had a lot of areas in the single digits yesterday morning. And so this morning it's still cold. It's in the 20s and we're just not going to warm up much today. Lots of clouds overhead and the winds will be around 5 to 10 miles per hour this morning, picking up 10 to 15 miles per hour this afternoon. It's a little bit of a breeze later today. 29 degrees by noon. High temperature this afternoon about 32 degrees. So you still need the full winter gear. It's going to be a cloudy day today. Occasionally a few flurries possible this afternoon. These have been your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you.